Hey guys, Movies and TVs on the ball here. It's Delightful DC again, and I it's summertime, so I'm thinking about the ocean, and what other person to think about the ocean than Aquaman. Yes, Aquaman, the king of the sea in the DC comic books. What's your thoughts on Aquaman? Mainly as a character, um, you know, I've know that due to super friends that aquaman isn't very much interesting you know but he's got a pretty good um he's got a pretty good pedigree in the comic books he is sort of more of a badass in the comic books but then you had aquaman the two aquamans you know let's start with jason momoa who really kind of solidified Aquaman as a badass character because his skin is hard. He, you know, they really took the tropes and, um, you know, went through the history of Aquaman as a character. Now, I haven't seen Aquaman 2, but Aquaman the movie wow, was a pretty good, solid flick. And then you had Justin Hartley who you guys probably know nowadays from This Is Us, but he was in a pilot episode for the television series Aquaman. I've never seen Aquaman, which was supposed to be kind of like a sidekick to Smallville in a way, kind of a, a sequel series that was created by the same guys who created uh, Smallville. I, I haven't seen it, but I did listen to a podcast on it. And, um, but if you have seen it, let me know in the comments below. Um, what are your thoughts on Aquaman in the Super Friends? I don't know if he, what's he like in the animated television series of the Justice League. I've played him in video game form in, um, shows like, or in games like Injustice, uh, DC's Injustice and Mortal Kombat versus DC as well but what's your thoughts on aquaman do you feel like he's just a loser that talks the fish or is he a aqua badass let me know in the comments below and as always like and subscribe let's get a conversation going and as always see you at the movies bye